traveling through another dimension. A dimension not only of sight and sound, but of mind. A journey into a wondrous land whose boundaries are that of imagination. Your next stop, the Twilight Zone. I thought you'd like to know that the boy will be all right. Doctors say he may limp some, but he'll be all right. Thank God for that. You dropped this by the house. I took a look inside. And? Told me quite a few things about you. Driver's license, credit cards, the money inside. It seems that you are Martin Sloan. You're 36 years old and you have an apartment in New York City. And it says your license doesn't expire until 1960. It's 25 years from now. And the dates on the bills, those dates haven't happened yet either. So you know now, don't you? Yes, I know. I know that you've come from a long way long way in a long time. But I don't understand why or how. But you know other things too, don't you, Martin? Things that'll happen. Yes, I do. You know... You know when your mother and I Yes, I know that too. Martin, you have to leave here. There's no place for you. Do you understand? I see that now, but I don't understand. Why not? I guess it's because we only get one chance. Maybe there's only one summer to a customer. But that little boy, the one that I know, the one who belongs here. This is his summer, Martin, just as it was yours once. Don't make him share it. Is it so bad where you're from? I don't know, I thought so. I've been living at a dead run pop. I just got so tired. I just hopped in my car and I knew I needed to come back. I just wanted to get on a merry-go-round, listen to a band concert, get some cotton candy. I just wanted to breathe, close my eyes, and listen, and smell. No, we all want that. But Martin, when you go back, maybe you find there are merry-go-rounds and band concerts where you are. Maybe you haven't been looking in the right place. You've been looking behind you, Martin. Try looking ahead. Maybe. Martin Sloan, age 36. Successful in most things, but not in the one effort that all men try at some time in their lives, trying to go home again. And also, like all men, perhaps there'll be an occasion, maybe a summer night sometime, when he'll look up from what he's doing and listen to the distant music of a calliope and hear the voices and the laughter of the people and the places of his past. And perhaps across his mind there'll flit a little errant wish that a man might not have to become old, never outgrow the parks and the merry-go-rounds of his youth. And he'll smile then too because he'll know it is just an errant wish, some wisp of memory not too important really, some laughing ghost that cross a man's mind. 
that are a part of the Twilight Zone. <laughs>